Hello from BI Consulting Services. Today we'll be setting up a simple sales environment in Dataverse. We'll begin by clicking New on the Environments tab and naming our environment Sales. We'll keep the region as United States and also the type as Sandbox. Once done, we'll go to make.powerapps.com and select environment at the top. Once we've done that, we'll click on sales at the bottom. We'll make the display name and the name sales and select the default publisher and then hit create. Next, we'll create a data flow. We'll click the back arrow, click on more and then click data flows. Once there, we'll click on New Data Flow and name the flow Sales Import. After naming the flow, we'll click Create and then select Excel Workbook. Next, we'll click Upload File and select our Sales Table Excel file. After we've done that, we'll select our sheet and then click Transform Data. Once we've done that, we'll click on the wheel next to our change, and then we'll scroll down to English, United States. After we've done that, we'll click next. Done that, we're going to keep the load to new table setting and change the table name to sales data. Once we've done that, click publish. If we go back to tables, we can find sales data under the tables tab. Once we've loaded the sales data table, we'll create a new column by clicking the plus button. We'll name the column total sales, change the data type to currency, and change the behavior to calculated, and then click save. In the Actions tab, we'll multiply the Unit Price column by the Units column. And then we'll hit the check. Now that we've set up our environment, let's import it into Power BI Desktop. After entering our credentials if necessary, we'll click on Sales and select our Sales Data Table. Once done, we'll use Direct Query. With Direct Query enabled, we can get our data in Power BI Desktop in real time from Dataverse. Now let's create some visuals for our data. We'll create a clustered column chart with product, salesperson, and units. As you can see, our most popular product is the tri-suit, and our best salesperson is Tom Cruise. Next, I've created a line chart with sale date and total sales selected. Now let's see what happens if we make a change to our total sales calculated column in Dataverse. We'll multiply our action by 10. When we click refresh, the line chart updates because of our change in Dataverse. As you can see, we now have a functioning sales environment connected to Power BI Desktop. Thank you for watching from BI Consulting Services.